it started out like basic stuff. I was like, I'm just gonna eat more fruits and vegetables and like not as many sweets. And then it started spiraling. And Brianna Wolken was a sophomore running track in high school when she first started experiencing symptoms. I was an athlete and there was one girl that I would hear my coach say like, you need to gain a few pounds. And she was better than me, whereas I used to be able to beat her. And so I was like, Maybe I need to lose a few pounds, you know. Four months later, Wolken's mom and friends noticed a change. You know, I don't think I could have recovered as quickly or as fully as what I did without the friends that I had and without my mom being there and like, even though I hated her for it at the time, you know, forcing me to do what I needed to do. Wolken's mom helped her stick to the meal plans provided by her nutritionist and helped her relax at family events with food. Wilkins says she's also thankful for the support she got from her friends. Not everyone in her support group was as lucky. They would talk about like their friends wouldn't really get it and I mean to an extent nobody gets it if they don't have one but definitely having friends that are saying like I don't know what you're going through but like I support whatever you need to do I, I really do think it makes all the difference. Although the road to recovery can be rough, Wilkins says it's worth it. It's like it's a miserable way to live and once you finally like break out of that. Looking back at how much I've gained in terms of just like freedom and just like enjoying life more. Wilkin hopes to work with a nonprofit in the future and to continue to spread her message of hope. So you're always deserving of help and there's always help out there once you reach for it. Olivia Eiler, News Channel 12.